you know, that, that's kind of the, the, the sort of difference between, I mean, I, I, I want to make beautiful things. I work very hard at, at making the things that I make um, objects of beauty, but I, but, but I don't um, want to necessarily always have them read as my, as, you know, my signature or something that I've made. And, and my work differs a lot. I'm working in Miami. It's very different to the work that I'm doing in Los Angeles or the work that I'm doing in Cleveland. Each of them is about the character of that sort of place. So, you know, I, I agree. I, I mean, I'm not egoless, you know. I, I, I've um, worked for a long time and, and you know, I believe I've got certain rights to express <laughs> my work, but I, I, I feel like my work is a framework as well for other people. What was how the other question? How do you, how do you, <laughs> go without, how do you, um, do you ever stop and check what your intent is as you're designing? My intent got developed a long, long time ago, and, and it has to do with the idea of freedom and the idea of how you can create opportunities and freedom for others. So that, you know, like the model of the most perfect architecture for me is a building like this, that right now is this. When we leave, someone will take away the chairs and it'll become something else. You know, I, I mean, I like architecture that's loose fitting and that allows opportunity and transformation and difference and accepts time as a, real part of it. 